Here, Lucy and I are taking a look at three of the... Which species is this? It's our constitus... I can't say it. Um, it's the 11 arm, it's the naive sea star. It's melting behavior, which just isn't normal. Sick, sick. Look at him, he's disgusting. <laughs> 15 minutes later, and now one of our sea stars has... In the opposite tank. In another, a different tank. Is second now, tank. Has lost, has lost two, two legs. legs. And this one looks like it's about to pop off as well. That looks like a lesion there that's turning yeah. like red too on the on the leg there. Is that which one? Right here. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I didn't even know what that was. What is that? But they're disgusting. <laughs> or fish. Or fish. Because they're really obviously if they're sick. Yeah. But <laughs> so like, it's just not. <laughs> found an 11 arm sea star here in the near shore at low tide, um, exhibiting some of the symptoms of the seagrass wasting disease. Uh, excuse me, the sea star wasting disease. Um, he's already got some lesions forming. Come in here and get in a little closer. There's some lesions forming. too good until all the way around down the arms but we'll take a video of the shore there's a lot of dead ones down here so see how we go Down here at Port Arlington with one of the sicker yeah, stars that we've seen. Um, this one's, gonna come this off. one's got a lot of white tissue, and you can literally just rip these limbs off. Although it doesn't look like he's alive any longer. Um, no, he's still moving. Behind him is a trail mark. So <laughs> this is what we saw in the lab as well, minus this white coloration. But just really easy detachment. Well, we started to see where that white coloration was. We started to see it go yellow, and then it. Now it looks like maybe the next step would go white. Yeah. You think? I think it might have just been accelerated in the lab too. That. I'm starting to be able to tell what some typical signs are in the wild here of um, these infected sea stars. This one's in a little bit deeper and cooler water, yet you can see that reddening and swelling in the armpit region and the radial lines, possibly where there's um, edema or some kind of the tissue may be pulling away. Um, this one still has all of its limbs. Um, maybe when Lucy gets here we'll have a look on, on how delicate it is. So that is how a sea star should behave when out of the water. Rock hard like cardboard. This is not how a sea star behaves. Floppy, floppy, disgusting. <laughs>